Welcome to Are You Game, where our players try their hand at a series of challenges that will test their skills and their tolerance for looking dumb on the internet. Today's prize is lukewarm gazpacho. Is that from the trunk of your car? And Let's get to it. Our first challenge involves our contestants shuffling an oversized deck of cards with their normal sized hands. 60 seconds to shuffle these three times. What do I do with the other 50 seconds? Are there style points? Points for panache and pizzazz. Sometimes we surprise ourselves and hoping that I can do that today. Don't even need to go fast. Boom, boom, boom. Oh gosh, oh gravy. This is so much harder than it looks. Oh. Boom, boom, boom. So shuffle! Let's prove it. Five, six, set, okay, okay. Three, five, six, shuffled. Was this your card? No, but it was close. Eric, that's how your last credit card got stolen. Boom. That's that. Boom. Dylan takes an early lead with several successful shuffles. Guys, I don't think I see the three of clubs anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> cool trick, bro. <laughs> We've given our players a random tool to pop as many bubbles on sheets of bubble wrap as they can. I got two left hands. Don't know what kind of operation we're running here. This feels goofy, but I love that we're recycling. If this is my instrument to use, then uh, easy. Before we get to our next round, we want to tell you about today's sponsor. Cactuses with googly eyes. Are you scared of a cacti? Put little googly eyes on it and you'll find it. No, no, no. Uh, today's sponsor is actually Scentbird. Scentbird is a subscription-based fragrance service. Scentbird gives you the opportunity to receive scents from over 600 brands. They've got scents from men and women, as well as scents from top designer brands like Prada, Gucci, Versace, as well as indie scents. I'm not the indie scent. But unlike that impression, these scents are 100% authentic. And if you can't decide what you want, take Scentbird's online quiz to help them discover something that you're gonna love. Never get bored of your scent and save hundreds of dollars without wasting unfinished bottles. Get a luxury fragrance for just $7 with promo code VAT19. That's 55% off savings. This month, I'm trying Dolce & Gabbana. Mm, you smell like a winner, Ben. Speaking of winners, let's get back to the action. Yeah. Many people would think that you would use the point of the pencil, but I'm gonna roll it out like a rolling pin. Let's all be quiet so we can hear the popping. Pop, 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 none of them are popping. There it is. Second one in the bin. Like butter. Are these pre-popped? Did somebody sabotage me? You want to preheat your recycling bin to 350 degrees, put it in and wait 45 minutes. And that's how recycling works. Can we go back? What if I have a gas recycling bin? <laughs> Dude, it's easy. Reduce reuse. Sloan takes the round with Dylan close behind and Jamie tantruming his way into third. Whatever, I'll make it up later. On to the next round. In this round, our contestants have to answer trivia while eating weird candy. I swore to myself that I was never gonna eat a worm, but we'll just try it. Yeah. There we go. Oh, it's got a little bit of kick to it. <laughs> this is hot. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, earthy. What is the name of the biggest ocean on planet Earth? Oh, dear. Gotta be the Pacific Ocean. Or the Atlantic? Uh, the Atlantic. Maybe it's the Pacific. Oh, oh. We're gonna go Pacific? It's Pacific. It is the Pacific Ocean. Yeah! Oh, I love that. Let's keep it moving. Points to Jamie and Sloan and a consoling pat on the shoulder for Dylan. Oh, I don't, if I was confident, you would believe me. What was the first soft drink in space? That orange powder, Tang. Was it Tang? Curly Coke, right? Sloan got that one right. Coca-Cola was the first soft drink in space. While Tang was in outer space, it is not a soft drink. Oh, man. <laughs> Incorrect. Final question, how many hearts does an octopus have? Follow-up question, how many octopus hearts does Eric have? What? 
It's got eight flippers. I'm gonna be crazy and fake no hearts. One. Yeah, I think I know this. I think an octopus has three hearts. Three is the correct answer. Are you it? Oh my god, it was hot. Woo! Go. I'm gonna eat it. Extra points to Dylan for cleaning his plate. That was good. Do I like eating worms? Sloan and Dylan take the points in that round while Jamie falls behind in third place. Angry and hot. My tongue's on fire. To the next round. In this round, players have 60 seconds to bob for as many brain stress balls as they can chop. Hairs up, glasses down, time to dunk in brain town. 60 seconds, start chopping. Oh! oh. oh. Dylan loses five points for growling. Not tall enough! <laughs> I'm fringing these brains! Got it! No! Jamie putting his mind over gray matter by climbing onto the table. Oh, I have it! I feel like I won, right? Like, that has to be the ballpark. <laughs> Time! <sighs> Got them all! <laughs> ah! I'd like to apologize. I, I lost myself there for a second. Dylan and Jamie with the tie, but the tiebreaker goes to Jamie for drinking more brain water. Electrolytes. Total domination, as expected. What? Told me I didn't win. <laughs> what? Time to get our minds on the next game. <laughs> For this round, our players have 60 seconds to eat as much gummy as they can. I own a candy store. Without using their hands. No hands allowed? Sure, Ben. When they do it, it's all fun and games. But when I do it, my doctor says you've got a problem, Eric. It smells like a ripe blue slushy. We're going zombie style on this bad boy. Mm. 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 Bite. It's delicious. Dylan, taking a quick break here to leave a review? Woo! That's a frontal low, baby! Three apples, cut. 30 seconds. Don't let Dylan see this. <laughs> oh yeah, go like fruit punch. Five seconds. Eat a thing in your mouth. Counts. You don't, you don't oh. Oh. oh! That 19. Slow there. Woo! No one look at me. I'm so sorry, Grandma. Wait, is she saying she's eating the brain of her grandma? Oh, God. 54 grams. 73 grams of pure gummy protein. Yes! Sometimes you really do surprise yourself. Anyone who tells you that eating gummy has no real world application, send them this video. Jamie and Dylan are our top two point getters, so they're headed to the final round showdown. Let's see if Dylan can unseat the champ. And also, let's see if they ate the rest of that gummy, because I'm hungry. You seem nice, but you're my mortal enemy right now. A lot of people don't know this, but me and Jamie are actually best friends. It's just <laughs> not true. Uh, might change. In this round, our contestants must create their own tic-tac-toe piece by chewing ramen a soda gummy. Go! Oh, I dropped one. Who cares? I only need three anyway. This thing. Okay. Oh! That is oh. delicious, by the way. Ooh. <laughs> Jimmy's one of the smartest guys at Bat 19, so I feel like he already has a strategy. He's trying to butter me up. He knows, too. Oh! Uh oh. <laughs> he nice. took the center spot though, so I'm at yeah. a disadvantage. Do it, my dad! Oops. Oh, oh, no! 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 no. <laughs> uh. Boom, boom, boom! Wisdom wins! As always, that's kind of nasty. <laughs> Jamie is our first two time champion of RU Game. Gaspacho all around! I'm disappointed that I lost, but I'm happy my best friend Jamie won. <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> Can't handle him! <laughs> Thanks again to Scentbird for sponsoring this video. Check out the link in the description for more information. And remember, you can find the fun products used here, plus hundreds of other curiously awesome gifts at bat19.com. Goodbye. Bat